so I have planned to share my Terraform knowledge with you guys. Uh, so this is completely free. Um, this is not in a specific course. I'll just create a video and share it across my in, uh, my YouTube channel. So whenever you have free time, you can come and uh, check it. So this is from uh, beginner to advanced course where you will get uh, very good understanding with AWS uh, Cloud and Terraform from end to from uh, zero to hero. Like um, you can go from production grade multiple accounts how to manage multiple accounts and how to deploy the applications in the cross account this and all you can learn uh, by the end of this course and you will be able to scratch your certificate uh, from the scratch you can uh, you can uh, able to complete your certificate of terraform associate with the course what i am going to cover so mostly i am going to uh, release uh, like a weekly thrice or four times uh, videos so be patient and um, stay safe so please subscribe and you will get notified when i release my new videos thank you so let's get it so why terraform so terraform is a one of uh, most popular infrastructure as a core tool available in the market due to its support of wide range of providers like aws azure GT gcp etc like uh, you can go with like there are a lot of providers you can go with openstack oracle alibaba cloud like terraform uh, supports around 100 more than 100 uh, providers more than 100 providers and uh, basic example i can give for terraform definition Terraform is a tool for building and changing and versioning infrastructure safely and efficiently. With the help of Terraform, you can manage existing and popular service providers as well as custom in-house solutions. Just we need to dis uh, describe in configuration files to Terraform, the components need to run on single application or entire your data center. So that is how the Terraform will work. So why this Terraform uh, is most popular? If you see in a, uh, nowadays any job description of your job DevOps role, each and every job description will have must uh, must and should lead have Terraform. So that is why Terraform has become one of the most known tools uh, for DevOps. Terraform has become one of the most tools for DevOps. So where the infrastructure code begins with the Terraform can manage includes low level components such as compute, instances, storage and networking to a well high level component such as DNS entries, SaaS features, everything you can manage with the infra as a code. So what are the main uh, areas I'm going to cover in this uh, series? So I will begin from absolute scratch and then move ahead with the advanced real time use case topics as I mentioned production grade deployments with cross accounts uh, cross account deployment in uh, multiple uh, multiple accounts with aws this is mainly going to aws so getting started and setting up the labs which covers windows and linux both and deploying the infrastructure with terraform in aws read and generate modify configuration terraform uh, provisioners modules and how the workspaces uh, will actually work with the real-time scenarios and the state file management that is remote state management and security considerations terraform enterprise capabilities and that final conclusion what we have learned from this course and uh, in the exam capabilities and exam uh, question, review and questions also we will provide at the last what are the key features of terraform terraform is basically used for infrastructure as a code and we can execute the plans and uh, if you want to view and graphically you can go with the terraform resource graph and you can change the automation with terraform what are the use cases of terraform you can set up heroku app setup multi-tier applications self-service clusters software demos disposable environment software defined networking resource schedulers multi-cloud deployments even we have the uh, comparison like why we need to use the cloud terraform instead of uh, existing uh, infra as a code tools assume uh, aws having cloud formation azure is having their own uh, azure resource uh, manager ARM templates they are having so we will see the comparison uh, detailed comparisons comparison between aws uh, cloud formation and the terraform in the upcoming sessions and if you have any uh, further uh, any questions or further information if you need to know just comment out in the comment section in this uh, video and uh, 
please uh, do subscribe and like and uh, share with your friends if they want to learn this terraform course from scratch to advanced so thank you again